Hi Virgos! Welcome to my channel, we're doing your reading. How are you? Feeling cute, Sal? Might delete later. Isn't that the thing? <laughs> you guys are funny. Okay. Sit down, we're doing your reading, Virgo. What's the rush? Okay. What's the rush is the rush hour. Okay. So, do you understand the, the words coming out of my mouth? Right? That's the rush hour. Mm-hmm. I can do that. You can't. You're not Asian. Okay. <laughs> but it wasn't really... No, it was not Jackie Chan who said that. It was actually... Is it Chris Rock? Chris Tucker. Chris Tucker, right? Okay. So anyhow, uh, you know, enough with the jokes. Let's go with the read. Intuitive first, and then we go for the um, the tarot. But, you know, I, I go the same. You know, I, I go read it both at the same time. Okay. So don't expect gazillion cards. Expect gazillion messages. Okay. So I pop in. Okay, this is the first thing. I pop in. Okay, so there's someone is goo goo gaga over over you, Virgo. I mean, I mean, hello, right? Um, I feel like Virgos. Okay, we're gonna go there. Okay, um, how to be how how can a Virgo be attractive? Okay, they just look like a whole package. Okay, this is what you're getting when you're getting it. If you're a cross watcher and you're hating on a Virgo, of course you're gonna be hating on the Virgo. It's a cross watcher, meaning it goes vice versa, right? You're gonna hate also the one that you're cross watching. It goes like that. But let me explain to the people here who's watching what you like first in a Virgo before you start hating them. All right? <laughs> um, like it's a whole package. It's really their perfection. Okay, it's their strive to perfection that they try to attain with everything. And they all also look like, you know, it's like a package. You get everything, okay? The looks, okay? Because it's, it's not a Leo fifth house, oh, I look good. No, this has a backing of I look good because I'm perfect, okay? <laughs> like, I can do 4K camera cell and the pores are so clear. Mm -hmm. There ain't no makeup here, so it's all au natural, okay? So if you're wondering, it's just like, yeah, it's easy to fall for a Virgo. And then they're critical. And then it's all it's all it's all downhill after that. <laughs> I like you, Virgo. Oh, don't worry. M1, okay. So, so you can't bring us up and attack us at the same time. I can. We cool, we cool. Okay, so yeah, so somebody's falling Google Gaga Google Gaga over you. Everything about you is just a package. This is what they're saying. And if you're a bro, then go. Okay, talk to your bros that you got a package. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, something about... Uh, um, so, this person who likes you, who's going crazy about you, I'm pretty sure you already got a picture. You know what I'm talking about. Okay? So, you guys already have gone through that level. Okay. Probably you guys already have been intimate. Okay, because that's just appalling. If you get a picture and it's like... We just, we just talked to texting today. What is this, right? Okay. So you guys have already gone through that stage. You guys know each other. You guys know, you know, the deepest part of each other already. There's nothing, you know, this is not a reading for those people. It's like, well, we just met two days ago. No, it's not. Okay. Um, something about, like, you visited already their town. They visited your town already. You guys have already crossed paths, like, a lot of times. Meaning, um, there was an established connection between the two of you. Then what's the problem? We'll go there. I feel like this person, um, either you or this person has a strain on the uh, neck, either you have a stiff neck or something like that, okay. Um, I don't have any problem, but I feel like this person is, okay. Um, probably this person um, is very fond of eating steak. This is what they're saying. It's a meat lover, meat lover, meat lover. It's not a pizza. Okay. They like steak. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Let me see. So what's the problem? Problem is we're in a long distance relationship, so that's where it started. Okay, this is where it started. Three of ones. We did the reverse forward, and by the way, 
if you saw the shadow behind me, I felt creeped out also. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> it's hilarious in the previous videos. Okay. So the three of ones, um, you know, it's like long distance relationship or, you know, it's like they're just, they're, they're just not a person near to you. It would have to be a driver, something like that. So you guys, you know, it's like you guys can frequent each other. Mm -hmm. You guys can. This person is waiting. Either you're waiting. Let's see. Okay. Is the three of one is waiting for their son, waiting for their, uh, you know, it's like your expectations to be met. You know. I feel like you're always also um, trying to wish that this person is next to you. You're in your feels. Just letting you know. Ah, que que horror. Three of swords. You're into your feels. No wonder. And I asked, what's the problem? Oh, so, there you go. Did that answer? Yes. Thank you, Sir Kasim. Virgo. <laughs> I got it. I got it. No. <laughs> Three of swords. What's the problem, Sal? That's the biggest problem that you know. Mm -hmm. Three of swords. We broke up, Sal. We broke up. I don't know why. Okay, then we'll, we'll figure it out. Okay. They had their own thing. You have your own thing. You guys didn't agree. Bam. Very cup. Most of the time, the Three of Swords, they related to a third party. Was it? You would have to know. Because normally, these are racing thoughts between you and this person that causes problem. The difference with their mentality and your mentality, you know, creates... That's where it starts, okay? The disagreement. So, Three of Swords here. So, long distance, they're far from you, and they broke up. So, probably very recent how oh, you guys have separated. <sighs> Does this even get worse than this? Two of Cups. Okay. Are we digging your hole for tonight? Okay, Virgo. Because the Two of Cups here shows like the love was crazy. Okay. I don't, sen I don't sense any third party. I feel like this Three of Swords, I'm not sugarcoating it. It was divine. It was, Sal, we broke up. What do you mean divine? It was meant to end. For a reason, we would never understand the universe. Okay. Same thing, why does the frog grip it? Do you know? I don't know. Do you know? The universe probably told the frog to grip it, grip it, grip it. Something's just happened. Your breakup was beyond... I don't think there is a reason. It's just... You guys have broke up. But the love is there. See? Your intuition and this person's intuition and mine, you know, it's like you guys still have... You guys still share this connection. Damn, I'm sorry, Sal. Okay. Dig my grave, Sal. I give you the shovel. And tell me, is it over? Because the card says so. Okay, fine. You're a smart ass tonight, Virgo. Okay, understand. You guys went through a difficult stage. Three of swords, you have ten of swords, Virgo. We, in, in my native country, we call this double dead. Okay, so how does double dead? Because in first world country, people wouldn't know what a double dead is. So there is a chicken that they sell in the market. Okay, the double dead is a, a sick, chicken died okay and then you would have to uh, butcher the dead chicken who died of a sickness you understand me so it's double dead you're killing it it's already dead and you're gonna sell it into the market which is toxic right well third world country does that okay so a dead chicken resold okay so you're already dead three of swords the relationship is already suffering three of swords and ten of swords it's just like it just happened now we literally just broke up there is no saving this, you know, it's like I gave up, the person gave up, okay. So there's nobody who wants to, to come back from this. But that's sad. Oh, and I said nobody wants to come back and then there's the temperance. So you guys have had this connection already. Break up, come back, break up, come back. Okay, now I understand. So this is not double dead, okay. So I take back the chicken, okay. Let the chicken live, Sal. Run, chicken, run. There's a movie, right? Run, chi oh, chicken little. Uh, right. Chicken little. Okay. So at least the chicken is saved. We are vegetarians, right? Uh -huh. Temperance here. Uh -huh. So now let's come back again. Let's, uh -huh. let's be back together. Let's reconcile. Let's work it out. You know, it's like there's a future between the two of us. Uh -huh. All right. Okay. I'm hearing the word Kathy. I'm, I'm not making fun. Normally, Kathy is the assistant that I yell, I yell at my imaginary person. <laughs> but I'm hearing the word this time, Kathy. Oh, sometimes I cannot trust myself anymore. Okay. Join the rest of the exes. Okay. 
<laughs> so that's a shade to your ex. No, I can be trusted. No. <laughs> Emperor over here, you know, it's like you stand your ground. It's just like I know what I did, and I'm and if I was wrong, I was wrong. I take ownership of that one. Um, you're going to be persuaded by this person. It's a younger person that you have connected. They're going to try to uh, to win you again. And this time, I'm not sure if you're going to just welcome this person. Two of Swords, that's their call. That's their call. They're, this person is rushing towards you. Um, they really don't know what happened also. They don't know how you guys have wind up breaking up again. Here's the thing. If you guys keep breaking up and coming back, they're probably something that you guys keep doing and doing again. It's the same thing. Same action, same result. And that's why, you know, the relationship, the foundation of the connection is always breaking apart. Why? I'll let you know why. It was never a relationship. <gasps> Burn. Virgos. It was never a relationship. Why? It was always a three of ones. It wasn't fully committed. You or this person wasn't really, really there. You understand me? So it keeps falling apart. This time, I don't know. Because if they say third time's a charm, the third party here is the third time that you guys are going to reconcile. That's the third party. If you're banking on a third time's a charm, we'll see. Okay? So, this is not about on and off. On and off is like, we're together, we're not together. This is like, we totally break up, Sal. That's not off, off. That's a period, period. You got me? Okay. So, I'm going to continue this reading as this person, because you're the emperor. You're being... Um, chase right now or this person is gonna message you that's page page or messenger night is messenger they're rushing okay they don't know how to get to you though two of swords but they're just gonna go at it okay and I felt like you never give up though you're the emperor I don't feel like you were faced about this like so we've done this how many times so I'm not gonna cry anymore I've cried how many times there's nothing it's just a thing that we do now, okay? It cannot be accepted like that. You understand me, Virgo? <laughs> How dare you point me? It's like, you can. Okay, I can. Okay. Link down there in the extended. Let's see. You could be connected with a Sag, Aries. And let me see. You got a water sign. Mm -hmm. Okay, a little bit here. All right. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. I'll see you in the meetup. Bye.